Hola! Grand Tag! Privet! Namaste! Moi! Ni hao! Konnichiwa! Shalom! Ciao! Aloha! Hello! And welcome to my Angel vs. Emily podcast, Season 3, Episode 47, also known as my 17th Christmas in July video year 2. And as you can see, I'm still in my on-location closet. So anyways, guys, let's get started. <sighs> Baby, it's cold outside. You know, I never really thought of the deep message behind that song until I saw the top and Christmas songs with dark messages or dark meanings behind them with Olivia Kozlowski. Hi Olivia Kozlowski or hi Olivia K since I don't know how to pronounce your um, last name. Um, as it turns out a woman is trying to leave a man's house but the man keeps on questioning her to stay with him, which is very creepy and menacing and weird. And it turns out that I, a few years ago, people have been listening to that song and has been discussing about its message and or the meaning behind that song and yeah, it does sound creepy once you think about it. But anyways... <laughs> the people who made Elf put that movie in, put that song in, without even knowing the message. And it's a very really dark message. And... I guess it does make sense when you think about it, like... The woman in that song tries to leave a man's, the man's house, but the man keeps on trying her or coursing her to stay with him. That just sounds so weird and wrong and just creepy once you think about it. But I guess, but I guess we never even, but I guess we never even noticed it until we really think into it, don't we? But enough of that, guys. So, and so that's why they don't play that song as much as they used to because of the meaning. Oh well, at least we'll still have lots of classic Christmas songs. <laughs> yeah, okay. Now time for today's Did You Know? Did you know that the reason why Sheldon Cooper in The Big Bang Theory doesn't like Christmas or Santa Claus or any part of the holiday season is because his Paw Pops actually died on Christmas Eve and he asked Santa Claus to bring his Paw Pops back and so, and so that's why he doesn't like Christmas But anyways, I love Christmas, I'm sure that the majority of you do too. Thank you so much for watching my podcast. I feel the love online. I give it back to you. Go out there and spread it on the world, because we need love in the world right now. In the words of Ellen DeGeneres, have a, have a wonderful night, or a wonderful day, wherever you are in the world. And as usual, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Hashtag support Ukraine.